All right, so getting started here. Uh, you good to go? Ready to roll? Uh, actually, I, I got to get this out of the way first. A couple weeks ago, I had to have a quick um, procedure done on my groin. Nothing major, but it's um, it's going to be. I'm going to be limited for a couple weeks in camp. So uh, you know, I feel great now. I feel fine, but the the uh, trainers want to take it slow, make sure everything heals properly, and. Um, so that I'm 100% for the start of the season. So are we talking one practice a day, or are we talking doing stuff on the side with the trainers, or? I think, uh, I mean, you gotta check with them, but I think to start off with, I'll be doing stuff on the side, you know, just getting back into it on my own. Um, but I feel like I'll, I'll be back with the team pretty fast because it was a really, really minor thing. Um, it was just a, a really solve a small problem now, so it doesn't become a bigger one later. Okay. Um, but I, I, like I said, I feel great right now, but uh, they, they just want to take it really slow and be real cautious with it. Was that something that you did in the weight room or something that came out of the spring camps? Or? Something I did and in, in, uh, I just tweaked something in OTAs and mini camps and uh, you know kept going on and didn't think much of it and just kept getting a little bit worse and worse. And then we finally decided to, um, like I said, just take care of it now so that I can get through the season perfectly fine and, uh, and not have something creep up on me later on in the year. And that was early July or a couple weeks ago? Yeah, I, I, the, the procedure was two weeks ago, two okay. weeks ago today. Um, but when I first did whatever I did, you know, when I first tweaked it, it was in, um, you could say, in the middle of OTAs. Okay. With the changes in the defense, is it going to be put you behind at all, not being out there with the guys at this point? I mean, it's, it definitely would be a lot better if I could start uh, fresh with the guys. But, you know, I feel like um, I was able to pick up the defense pretty well during OTAs and minicamp. Um, but I definitely need to be out there, you know, especially now that we have pads on and it's the real deal. Uh, I need to be out there and getting comfortable hitting again, you know, fitting fitting this in this style of defense. So um, I am going to be a little bit behind. That's for sure. I wish I could start, you know, start tomorrow with the guys. I feel like I will be a little bit behind, but hopefully I'll be able to catch up when I get back out there. So you wouldn't be a PUP candidate. They, they told me they're not going to put me on there. Yes, because I'm, I'm still going to, if we do, Walkthroughs or anything like that, stuff half speed. I will be able to do that. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I won't be on that list. So anxiety really didn't set in because you knew this was a preventative measure more than anything else to kind of help you long term. Absolutely. I mean, you never want to you never want to miss time. Um, but the, with the options they gave me, they said take care of it now, miss a couple weeks of camp, and be great for the season, as opposed to. Um, uh, letting it linger, it's going to get and having it get worse on me at, at week seven or eight, and then it get real bad. So I just thought, you know what? Let's let's solve the problem now. Uh, miss a little bit of time now, and, and make sure I'm 100% for opening day. You know, Paul, most of the uh, national publications are picking. You know, you guys finish last in the AFC East and kind of bottom of half of the, of the league, right. really. What do you think about that? And you know, your thoughts heading into the season. I mean, if you if you take our record from last year and, and say we had a lot of problems going into the soft season, quarterback, offensive line, new defense. I mean, why wouldn't you say that? You know, but it's it's our job to go out and prove them wrong. So, you know, we have a lot of confidence in our abilities and what we can do on the field. Uh, but the biggest you got to go out and perform. You know, that's obviously the biggest thing. We got to go out, win football games from the start, and then all that will change. Thanks, Paul.